Montana Waterways will be seeing a lot of action over this holiday weekend, at least the 4th of July tomorrow, and Fish, Wildlife and Parks is asking that you stop at those mandatory watercraft inspection stations before and after visiting the lake or the river. It's in an effort to help stop the spread of aquatic invasive species such as zebra mussels. FWP says if you stop at an inspection station at 7 in the morning and then pass that same station when you're returning home at 2, you have to stop again. Boaters who pass an inspection station without stopping for inspection can be pulled over. To speed the process up, boaters can use a watercraft inspection passport that can be issued to watercraft inspection stations. But even if you don't have one of those yet, the whole process is pretty quick and painless, according to FWP. The stops are usually really quick. Uh, you just pull in, there's a quick observation of the vessel, some questions. If you've been through a station before, it's even quicker because you'll probably have a passport in hand that they'll take a look at, ask you a few basic questions and send you on your way. The only time it might take a little longer is every now and then we do catch a boat uh, with an, a, some sort of species on there that needs to be de decontaminated. So that's, you know, just illustrates how important it is to stop. But, but typically it's a really routine in and out under five minutes. People camping at Canyon Ferry or Tiber Reservoirs can get a validation pass to expedite the process at those decontamination stations.